Hey guys, so this is the third time I try to film this. This is the second episode. I can't believe it's two days in a row. This is not going to be like that every time. Okay, but today I was writing a song in my little butterfly book. I was writing a song for Lady Nades and I thought, why not make the next episode about songwriting? So, what I want to ask you is, are you a songwriter? I am. The thing is, I ask you because there are artists that don't write their own songs. And not only independent artists, artists like Celine Dion, Whitney Houston, they don't normally write the songs they sing. However, I recommend you, if you're an indie artist, you should do it. Why? Because Let's be honest, as an artist, we only get about 15% of the amount of the money that is being made of the songs that we perform. But if you're the author of the song, you're not only getting that money, but you're getting the author money, the performance royalties, it's called. So. I recommend you to start writing your own songs. At least make it 50-50. 50% of the songs you write, 50% of the songs somebody else writes. If you're not quite ready or you don't think you're ready. I started uh, writing my own songs when I was like 12, 13. I was trying though to write them in English. I'm not an English speaking person as you can tell by my accent. My, my born language is Spanish, but I felt so much English and I was listening to so much, so much music in English that I felt like I could do it. I obviously couldn't and the songs were pretty lame, but with time I started learning a little bit more English and I started writing more songs in English and with the help of um, Frankie Biggs, which is my husband, um, he encouraged me to keep on writing and now I'm lucky enough that I don't write, I don't write only for me, I write for other artists and I'm very, very grateful for that. Now, if you start writing your own songs or writing songs for somebody, because there are uh, songwriters too, there are not artists. If you start doing that, what you should do is join a PRO, which is a performance rights organization. In the US, you have three, BMI, ASCAP, and CSAC, but in the rest of the world, you have other, like here in Spain, Sky. Uh, in the UK, is PRS, if I'm not mistaken, and in Canada, is SOCAN. So you register your songs there, and then when somebody perform them, performs them, either you, if you're the artist, or somebody else, you get money. Now there are some legends about this stuff, like you get money every time a song is played in the radio. It doesn't really work like that, but I'll get into it in another episode. For now, I think we're good with what we have today. So I ask you, are you a songwriter?